Guys, today we can discuss about a device. We often feel confusions on a device, I mean ADVIC and ADVIC. Let's discuss it in detail today. Firstly, let's take the word a device, ADVIC. It is a noun. Firstly, let us take the word advice a d v i c as you know that it's a noun which simply means that an opinion or suggestion that is given let's see how we can use the term advice in oet letter we use the term advice in introduction paragraph assessment or main body paragraph and even in the discharge plan. In introduction paragraph, we often use the term advice. See some examples now. Mr. John requires advice regarding low fat diet. Another one, Mr. John requires advice regarding dietary management. We also use the term advice in main body paragraph i mean in the assessment paragraph let's see some examples she was given advice to follow low fat diet she was given advice to follow low fat diet another one he was given advice regarding smoking cessation then we can also use the term advice i mean non form in the recommendation or discharge plan see these examples please provide advice on low fat diet another one kindly advise her the importance of maintaining healthy lifestyle now let's see the second scenario now let's see how we can use the term advice a d v i s e which is the verb form in oet letter first of all Advice A D V I S E is a verb that means the act of giving an opinion or suggestion. We use the term advice in the main body paragraph and discharge plan. I mean recommendation paragraph. Let's see some examples in assessment paragraph. During hospitalization, he was advised to follow low fat diet. Another one. During hospitalization, he was advised regarding the importance of smoking cessation. Now, let's see how do we use it in discharge plan. That means a recommendation paragraph. Kindly advise him to follow low fat diet. Another one, please advise her to go for a regular checkup with her general practitioner. Please advise her to go for a regular checkup with her general practitioner. Thank you.